Hello hopefuls, thanks so much for coming back to my channel today. I hope you guys are doing great. You're staying safe and healthy. I had to do a grocery Walmart pickup today and then I also had to go in there, which seems like it always happens, even after I add to the order. Sasa, even if I add to the order before the cutoff time. So now, last time you guys will see a video where it was JJ's birthday and I went to, had a Walmart pickup, went inside and shopped before. Um, it was two days that I had to do it out, plan it out. So if you want to do like Walmart pickup or something, you got to plan it out. In our area, you have to plan it out or you won't be able to get a spot. Also, I noticed that you have to wait my area, they're only opening up 60 slots, and he said normally at my last visit, they have 120 slots. So, they cut it in half, and usually I'm up late anyway, so about 1 o'clock, 12 or something, maybe later, that's when they open up more slots and you have to grab them. So, I think I ordered this on like on a Tuesday and I had to wait to Friday. Um, before it was like two days, this time it was like three days. Instacart is really far out. Um, but anyway, y'all. So, I tried to separate it by the Walmart pickup and by the store. And the reason why, too, <clears throat> I forget some things why I have to end up going into the store. But I also... They don't put everything on the website now, so you have to go in there and check and see if they have, they never have any paper anymore, but they have like some cleaning stuff or just certain things like even bread. So you just have to go in there and check. So anyway, <clears throat> I spent quite much. I do miss my Aldi. I can go on Aldi, but I just was worried if it was a line and then I don't want to be in there getting a bunch of stuff. If that makes sense, even though I still got a bunch of stuff, but it's a little different. Like all these are smaller, smaller store. So, but I haven't been in there, y'all. So let me know if you have, since they limit how many people go in there, and I just didn't want to stand in line. Okay, y'all. So I got some flour tortillas. I got two of these, and I'm gonna do a meal plan. This is mainly like some Easter stuff, and then also what we need to add to other meals, because I did a meal plan for two weeks. I got some Clorox um, bathroom cleaner. We needed any way to clean the bathrooms. And I went ahead and picked it up. It wasn't much. The Mr. Clean bath, I got this big thing. And these are the only things that get our tubs like sparkling clean because it's that fiberglass. And the boys need to clean theirs and I need to clean mine. Um, some pepperoni. I'm going to make a pepperoni bake with that instead of pizza because I was going to get pizza but one day I'm just going to make a pepperoni bake um, this was the only size of frozen peas I may have picked up some but I need to organize my freezer inside and out yeah in the garage too so I know what I have like put it in bags and stuff so I'm going to make a seven layer salad for Easter so I don't really need all this but I can use it for another um, some ground turkey. I my Coca Cola. Actually, I wanted Dr Pepper cherry, and Jason got that for me the other day at Food Line, and they don't have it or had it in stock, so they substituted for Coca Cola vanilla. And then I got them some Sun Kiss, the orange and the strawberry. Jason asked for the Louisiana Crunch Cake. I thought I put in my shopping cart. In the Walmart pickup, the variety K, and I was over there looking at it, thinking I already had it in my car, but I didn't. So I'm glad I picked this up because he wanted a Louisiana Crunch. If I'd known it, I would have got another one. But I know it seems like we got a lot of sweets, but I'm not going back out to the store. Um, some donuts. Jason likes these cheese balls. I think he's the main one. Everybody's eating them. But he's the main one eating it, so I forgot to put it in the grocery Walmart pickup. Some bologna. Mom was talking about a fried bologna sandwich the other day. And how we used to have it on Saturday after come back and after we came back from the grocery store. So anyway, I wanted some. They didn't have a lot of choices. They ain't even I don't even think they had any with the with the um not the rind, but the red part around it. I don't even think they had any of those. 
So I'm glad I pick. I have to pick up eggs, even though we already have some, but we're gonna dye some eggs. And so my Walmart pickup order, they gave me these extra large eggs as a substitute. So I guess when they did shop it, they must didn't have any eggs because they had plenty of eggs when I went in there. I got in the Walmart pickup, I got Saya some um, some of these eggs when we do an Easter egg hunt, and then he loves these. And then some peeps, these are for JJ. So, because not being really able, and I kept forgetting to order something from Five Below and all this stuff for their Easter basket, I said, I'm just not gonna worry about it this year and just get mainly concentrate on Saya and get them like some candy or something. So, this was a substitute. The Paz egg emoji, I wanted the ones with the cups, and I figured by the time it rolled around that my pickup date, they didn't have those anymore. Um, I got these Reese pieces shaped like a carrot. The ham was part of the main pickup, main thing that I wanted. Um, $21.29. Mm -mm. But hopefully it's good. Usually you guys know I go to Aldi. I, I will get it at Walmart, but they picked the biggest one, y'all. The biggest one. But they'll be eating off of it. I passed the bread about two or three times. I should have picked up another one of these Hawaiian rolls. It was in my order. This was also in my order. The peanut butter crackers. The cherries were in my order. I saw this when it popped up. I was looking for something. The seasoned butter beans. And I was like, oh. I'll pick that up and try it. I got some banana nut muffins. Some more peanut butter. I just picked up some last week, but they're going through it really quick because it's the Peter Pan honey um, peanut butter, and they love that. The pineapple slices. Some cherries. I had to go back in there and get this for the seven-layer salad. Not cherries, the tomatoes. The cherry mixed fruit. The diced pears. The tropical fruit. I must got sidetracked when somebody came down the aisle because I meant to get pineapple, but I don't think they had it in Walmart brand. Um, the premium romaine salad. I got it in the bag this time. I was hesitant, y'all, because they always have recalls, and I watched some story on romaine on lettuce, and it just like I'm like really hesitant to get certain lettuce now. So I got this. Probably it's probably no different from getting the you know, the head of the lettuce, but just really squeamish now about getting, especially romaine lettuce. I got some spring mix. They didn't have it in the tub, y'all. Um, the boneless, skinless chicken breast. They had quite many meats to choose from. A lot of frozen that was missing, like the, you know, Tyson's and stuff like that. Um, this is a five pound bag. It's about $9. And I got some red onions. Okay, over here, I added this to my shopping cart before my order. They usually, when you have a Walmart pickup, they give you a time frame. And I have lots of time when you have like three days out. So I added the severe toothache and gum relief for Jason because I kept telling him when I go to Dollar General, do you want me to get you some? And he'll be like, I'm good, I'm good. But um, I tell y'all, now is not the time to be going to the doctor's office and you know you got to be really careful because you know anything can happen you know you can cut yourself and have to go to the ER or the urgent care or whatever but um, he said he may have to make him an appointment I know my mouth was bothering me and he told me just take some leave and that did um, help because I had to get a feeling and that did help because I must still have some inflammation so anyway then I got him some Ambisol liquid, so I got him two things just in case. Looks like my, okay y'all, I was trying to turn my lighting down. This looks like it's washing stuff out. Okay, I also got the boys a shower liner. Theirs look disgusting. And so I added this, I was able to add this to my Walmart pickup. So you don't have to just get groceries. You guys probably know that. I got Jason two of these so he don't have to go out and this is long stretch his long stretch off. Um, let's see, some Flintstones complete. I picked these up for the kids. I probably should have got two boxes and 
Now it's looking like a funny color. Sorry, y'all. I was learning about my camera yesterday, so I was messing with the settings. The Sensodyne Rapid Relief. I needed some of this. The Women's Vitamins. And then a carrot cake. I hope it's good. For Easter. I got some triple cheddar shredded cheese. Um, a lot of times I like to have the cheese on hand because I don't know what I'm making. I'll put some cheese on it. But what I also do is I, um, I'll um i put it in the freezer if I know I'm not going to get to it. I got the sharp regular cheese and the mozzarella. And I got the big bag because I'm going to make some lasagna rolls. And then the pizza. And you know it's probably not enough. The pizza bake one day. And I got some everything Thomas bagels. I would like to eat this with some cream cheese and then the turkey sausage from Hillshire, but they still don't have any. So, ugh. Okay, so this is what I got for someone's little basket. So I went on there to see. Um, let's see. And this. So that's what I got him. Not a whole lot. And I still have like old baskets. So I can pull it out and use all the stuff and make it fancy. I got two of the Equate Maxi um, pads. The extra heavy overnight. I have to have these. And I was watching um, Boss Lady 76. Hey Sharon. She on her channel she was stocking up on some feminine hygiene products. And I was like you know what. I need to stock up on that too. You know, you need that just like paper products or if you need diapers or something like that. And Walmart didn't have any of the Tampax Pearl. I love to get those. And um, in there sh available. And I forgot to walk over there. But my plan was to go to Family Dollar. And I've been like, I only go once a week, y'all. Go couponing with Dollar General or Family Dollar. But I have not really shared that with you guys because I don't want you to feel like you have to go out or you see me pick up something and you go out. So, uh, I just can't do it. Um, maybe, maybe I'll show you guys tomorrow the Family Dollar deal anyway. But anyway, I had ice cream. So, that's why I didn't go because it's in my hometown next over and it was going to melt. So, I didn't go. But I need to go and do that deal they have a 5 off 25 on top of coupons and yeah so I need to go and do that deal because the coupons going to expire probably tomorrow okay the Taco Bell Mao taco seasoning mix I got two of these and I got some ground chuck one of these is mama's I didn't bring it by her house but she probably will be over here I got the boys some candy for their baskets, the big ones. They'll probably be fine with that. I didn't fool with like getting them some other stuff and I didn't plan y'all. I thought about it, but I was just like, forget it. I got them some Starburst, some Skittles, another Starburst, some Reese's. One of these Reese's, not the whole thing, is size size because he likes it. But I forgot I got those other ones over there, but I can hide it. But mama, <laughs> CJ was telling me that my brother, CJ, they told me this is good. He put it in the freezer with a coat. They told me this is good. I got some Almond Joy. This is mine. And Kit Kat. And again, this goes in their basket. And again, so we don't have to keep going back out. Okay, some Skittles, some Sour Patch Kids, some yams, some cut green beans. I'm going to make this for Easter. Some milk, some barbecue sauce. I'm going to make some crock pot barbecue wings. Some ricotta cheese. I thought I had some from the other order because I never made the lasagna rolls, but I didn't. Some sour cream for the seven layer cake. Some rotini for the pasta. What's it called? Uh, pizza bake I'm going to make. Um, this was the only fabric that they had. Um, of course, because everybody's making, well, they had the fabric on the bolt. I think that's what it's called, but they didn't have the quarters and I should have known, but I want some fabric because I'm going to redo these chairs for the boys. I'm going to make them a little home workstation and I'll probably work on that today because our county is still working on getting their curriculum together, but they, I think they have it together now and they're supposed to start Monday. So I want to make them a little station where they can sit, do their work, not be looking at TV and all this stuff. So anyway, I share with you guys what I do for them. 
the two little ones. Um, sweet tea. I got this. I need to clean my thing over here. That's why it's over here. Some broccoli florets. I got three of these. Some hot sausage. I think this is for the pasta pepperoni pizza bake. Um, some bacon. They were really selective with the bacon. I hate that they're so selective because you got to just get whatever and, and end up spending more money. Some Hot Pockets pepperoni pizza. I got them that. And I think that's it, y'all. That is it. Um, no, that's not it. Oh, let's see. I got two of the big 40 thing of water. Trail put it right here. But one of these is going in my laundry room um, to have to keep. And what I want to do is I was on Pinterest, y'all. And I don't think I, I try to share the link. And every week, if you want to like build your stockpile, every week you supposed to kind of like pick something up. So by the time the end of the year, I might need to read the blog post. You have everything that you need. So um, I want to have water anyway already piled, not piled, but stocked up. And I think the ice cream is the only thing I got and I already put that away. And then I have two loaves of bread, Nature's Own. They never have any Walmart bread. Um, yeah, yeah, and then Jason got this yesterday, so I got plenty of bread to put in the freezer. Okay, guys, so this is the meal plan for the next two weeks. Um, we actually st already started on the meal plan, but I tend, I wrote it down, I actually did write it down, so <laughs> I wrote it down on my Happy Planner half sheets, and I have my grocery list for the things that wasn't in the Walmart pickup, which you'll see in one second. Um, and I put it on these sheets here. So this is like a pad that I got from Dollar General. Let's see, let me go scan out. It was a dollar, yeah, a dollar, and it was 90% off, y'all. So it was like only 20 cents or something like that. So when, or 10 cents. So. I went back and I got more so I got like three pads downstairs two or three pads when I saw that it was only 90 cents because I like the layout of them and so anyway for breakfast I just put up here waffles cereal bagels I spelled that wrong pancakes and then if I feel like like making them some bacon or something like that um, and that'll be every day so that's why I put an arrow there and then lunches, sandwiches, or leftovers. So really they fend for themselves. Um, Josiah will ask for a peanut butter sandwich. I will give him some fruit or some yogurt. Stuff like that. Um, but the big boys, they fend, they fend for themselves. So for dinner, really I need to start over here. Because on Friday, I went to the store on Friday. So this was pizza bake. We, I put down pizza night, but it was pizza bake. Um, cause I didn't want, I didn't feel like buying a bunch of pizzas and I went to Walmart. I didn't go to Aldi to get their mama cozy pizzas that they always like to get. I'm trying to make sure y'all not covering up my mic or anything. Um, sandwiches. I didn't cook that day cause I knew I was cooking on Easter, which was Sunday, which was yesterday. So some ham, barbecue ribs, seven layer salad, string beans, yams, devil eggs and rolls. And I did record some of that for you guys cause you said you like those types of videos. And then um, today will be probably tuna fish sandwiches. So some of the stuff, um, I have it written out, but it may not be in that order. I may not make it in this particular order. That's what I want to say. <laughs> so tuna fish sandwiches, they love tuna fish. Um, fruit and some fries, french fries. Um, Tuesday, I have pork tenderloin. I have, I think, two left. And I think I already cooked the lemon pepper, so it's teriyaki or another one. And I think my mama just cooked hers and she mentioned about putting it in the crock pot. And I was like, I never thought about that. I just only thought about putting it in the oven. So you can do it either way. Mixed vegetables, which that probably is better because it won't dry out and, you know, it's easy peasy. Black eyed peas. Um, leftovers on Wednesday. I think I'm going to make Wednesday leftover day. Um, BLT sandwiches. Lettuce, tomato. And onion and then um let's see then that'll be like the weekend so we probably will maybe have some pizza um yeah so since I started here so on the weekend it'll be kind of like fend for yourself 
I don't know what Sunday will be, but um, probably pizza. Um, tilapia, broccoli, or rice on Monday. And that will either be brown rice. Yeah, that will be brown rice because I have some Trader Joe's brown rice. Lasagna rolls. I have veggies. I'm not sure what vegetable with that on Tuesday of next week. Um, leftovers because I'm sure there will still be some leftovers. Um, some chicken quesadillas. I may make this sooner. Sooner than next Thursday. I know Trail probably been waiting for some quesadillas. And corn. Um, I don't have any corn on the cob, but I do have like the corn in the can. And I thought I had some Spanish rice, but I don't know. I have to check and see. And some nachos. So I probably will mix that up so they won't be back to back. But they probably won't even care. Because they can have tacos every day of the week. Saturday and Sunday, I'm not sure yet. But um, I wanted to go ahead and do... A, you know what? I'm going to put cube steak because I did have that on Sunday. Yeah, cube steak on Sunday and Saturday will probably be sandwiches. Um, the cube steak will probably be with rice and a vegetable. And maybe zucchini swirls or something like that because I need to make that. Um, I haven't did the other two weeks. I wanted to do a whole month out at one time because I did do have enough food for a whole month. The plan out but what happens is if I decide to do something like on the whim that has something special that needs a special ingredient you know like a ranch dry packet seasoning or cream of mushroom soup you have to make sure you have all that but my goal is to have all those staples and stuff but anyway this is the meal plan but that is it y'all so thanks so much for watching sorry it was a little chatty hope you guys are doing great and let me know what you all been up to in the comments or what you are eating. Are you cooking more or you're exercising, you're doing something new, learning something new. So, guys, thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.